Hey Jace, this is Steven here from Eastside Dodge and this right here is the 2022 Ram 1500 Rebel Eagle Diesel. So starting up front, you get full LED lighting, turn signals, fog lamps, the whole works. You get a steel front bumper, you get a skid plate to uh, protect the oil pan and you get tow hooks down the front as well. Um, you get the sport hood up top and down bottom you get parking sensors, right? so it can warn you if you're coming up close to an object. As you noted on the phone, it does come with uh, fender flares straight from the factory, as well as knobby all-terrain tires, smaller wheel, fatter sidewall, built for uh, our climate in Canada. Going around to the side, as you see, this is a crew cab, short box configuration, has keyless proximity entry, power folding mirrors that are heated and auto dimming with convex as well integrated turn signals in here come around to the back you get steel bumpers back here as well class 4 hitch receiver 4 and 7 pin harnesses for your electrical and parking sensors down the bottom you also get dual exhaust backup camera and the tailgate is dampened so it doesn't just flop down when you open it now this vehicle, as you, as you see, does not have liner. Don't worry, as I mentioned on the phone, we have a contract with Linex. It will do, if you want that done, we can do it for you, and it'll be done well. You get a rear sliding window up there. Of course, it's four by four every now and then. We got the odd uh, two wheel drive truck in, but usually those are base model trucks. But of course, on this level of truck, they're all gonna be four by four. Now, moving on to the interior. Whoops. So, being a Rebel, you of course get all weather mats included. Get this out of the way for a moment. So back here, you get 60-40 split bench. Okay, revealing a totally flat floor. There's no driveline hump here. So tons of room for your dog, or maybe uh, you have a toolbox, or maybe you, you know you have a large box, whatever. It's not teeter-tottering a, uh, a driveline hump here. These fold back down, you get cup holders here, you get cup holders here, you get rear AC vents, three prong household plug, USB A's and C's, as well as a, a little slot there for your phone. You get speakers on the roof because this does have the upgraded Harman Kardon sound system. Sounds great, very clean sounding, has 19 speakers, 825 watts, um, it's quite the system. Uh, you get little bins on each side here. These are called ram bins, and I think you can use them as uh, beer coolers because this can pull out. So you can put your ice, once it's melted, you just dump it. You have one on each side, by the way, here and over there. Alongside those, you get tie downs, which is pretty neat. And that's, uh, that's about it. Also, leg room. I'm six feet tall, and uh, even me, I, there's no issue back here whatsoever. This vehicle also comes with remote start on the key fob, it has power folding mirrors, in case you're coming into a, uh, a tight spot. The seats are full leather with the Rebel script there. They're power operated with power lumbar support. The power, uh, the power, sorry, the gas and brake pedal are power operated. And the steering wheel is leather, heated, and tilt and telescoping. Hopping in. Now this is what we would call a loaded Rebel, okay? So the, it does have the 12 inch Uconnect 5 infotainment system. Has wireless CarPlay, wireless Android Auto. It's got uh, satellite radio free for one year. As I mentioned, you got heated seats, heated steering wheel. You have built-in nav, but of course with, you, with uh, sorry, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, uh, you have the ability to use Apple Maps, Google Maps, Waze, whatever your preferred map app is. Backup camera is extremely crisp. And uh, yeah, let's get into utility. So, big thing about the RAM here is the utility. So you get dual glove boxes, one, two. You get little pockets and doors, obviously at the bottom as well. You get storage on each side of the center console. And speaking of the city, the, the center console, you get a ton of room here. So number one, you get another USB in here. In addition to the USB A's and C's, and auxiliary 
right there up front. Now when you open up the whole entire thing, as you see, it's very cavernous in here. It's extremely deep. It's completely open underneath this panel. Up front, you have another three prong household plug. You get a little hidden compartment here, place to hold down, uh, hold your phones. It's ginormous. Um, in addition to that, this vehicle comes equipped with a trailer brake controller. Um, your parking sensors, your tow and haul mode, and that's of course your stability control. Uh, being a rebel, you have hill descent control and you have axle locker, locker as well. So to lock your diffs. Uh, this is your shifter. It uh, operates an eight-speed automatic, and that's tied to your three-liter turbo diesel V6 up front. Gauge cluster, you get uh, some customization there as well. And I think that pretty much sums it up. Home link garage door opener. There's a rear sliding window. Just a beautiful beautiful truck anyways Jace thanks for watching uh, let me know if uh, if you want to send your mom over to uh, test drive this vehicle I could uh, have it uh, parked up front warmed up and uh, we can ruin or sorry we can uh, run uh, a credit app as well thanks bye now